What do you get when you get two hungry van lifers, a van, and a rural island full of farm stands? A farm stand tour! Let's do it! Today is farm stand tour day! We're here, getting ready to go. And the first stop, I think, is kombucha. Homemade kombucha! They have change, money box, and then you transfer steps. Look at this. I'm so excited. Look, isn't that so sweet? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. <laughs> so, if you can see through this here, Yarrow is often only yeah, yeah. white, but this is pink and purple. It's so beautiful. Okay, I'm getting some Tuscan kale, but look at these beautiful flowers. Yay! This is the cutest! Oh, I'm so excited! Okay, we found a good one. This is a cute one. <laughs> Happy Amanda! <laughs> Potatoes! <laughs> Gosh, they're yellow potatoes too. <laughs> None of this like russet Burbank. <sighs> and the garlic. Can't forget the garlic. Like, on our way. On our drive, yeah. Yeah. one of my favorite farm farm stands. Woo, five bucks. I think I'm gonna like keep it good in the van. Oh, look. We'll come back another day and get a bouquet. Okay. Put my money in the slot. I love that you just gave me half a top. I'm, I tried to pull off more and I'll give you more in a second. The top is everyone's favorite. Okay. Mm, yeah, next farm. Next farm. Eat up quick. Traveling from the deep forest into the sun. This is an exciting one. Sorry. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited about these. So cute. See, like some of these have no change at all. No. <clears throat> Frank desperately wants some. Can I give him a little bit? He can have a little bit of cheesy bread. A little bit for Frank. Mm. This is so yummy. Mm -hmm. mm. Mmm, look at this thing. Mmm. Warm still. It's so warm. And the cheese is melty. And the peppers are hot and spicy. And it's covered in salt as well. So it Mwah. In the war, <gasps> there's never an option to run. 
That is amazing. Got beans, carrots, cukes, fresh sweet corn, and basil. I am loaded. Get yourself a friend that carries all your farm sand stuff so you can film. This is my injured arm. All our rest is in my door. <laughs> I'll get the gate for you. Habitat. Beach time? Beach time, buddy? You want some water? Franklin, you want some water? Because that is salty. Okay, I'm gonna let you go first. Oh, he no, he found his way down. Okay, Flossie. Don't fall over. Had enough injuries to yeah. last me a lifetime now. I'm looking forward to my new Many jandals arriving. <laughs> jandals are the kiwi word for flip flops. It's so nice to wear them and feel the jand between my toes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go to Australia or New Zealand. This is my and be like, guys. Do you want to go to the jandy beach? <laughs> this, this is my less the jand. <laughs> this is my less impressed face. Jandals are not called jandals because of sand. It's something completely different. <laughs> hey, look! It's a pixie in a tree. Oh, but the sap does smell really good. Time with your stick, Frank. He loves it. I mean, your piece of freaking firewood. Oh, bud. Yeah. I don't think I should throw it, but I can just hoof it back up the beach, please. I just want to be in the ocean. Amanda has found the flower of her people. Oh. <laughs> the flower of the purple flower people. <laughs> oh, it smells so good. Wow, they have lots of stuff here. Wow! Those are good looking. More taties. They have red ones, Amanda. What? Red potatoes. Berm cat. Human busy chasing mice. Lavender ice cream. It's delicious. Mmm. Mmm. So happy right now. My taste buds are in heaven. Being able to do this myself is on my bucket list. It's the end of a summer, end of a long hot day. It's just the lights in here are so beautiful. Oh, it's gorgeous.
I think a little thing of egg of these eggplants. Yes. And we have basil. Yes. Yum. It's grill night. So, veggie time. Here's where I'm at so far. So, zucchini, eggplant, carrot, garlic, potatoes, two different types of potatoes, and some tofu. Sounds good. I think. So clever. Potato, tool, and food. I'm pretty excited about dinner. Can't can't lie. I'm getting pretty hungry. Very hungry. Very <laughs> Little hungry. peckish. Coal is not the quickest igniter of fuels, but that's okay. This Sagittarian can wait. It's dark out here, campfire style. Mm-hmm. And the first thing ready is some eggplant. And I love eggplant. It's been pre-salted to remove the bitterness and then sat for a little bit before we put it on. Should we taste? Mm-hmm. Right after I get rid of my smoke eye. Which one do you want? Well, I mean, I'm not fussy. Okay. Just take the top one. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Oh, this good. Frank, <laughs> Frank I'm Frank. <laughs> he just wants to be part of the picture. There we go. It's going to be so yummy. I'm so excited. <sighs> Thanks for cooking. You're welcome. I'm really grateful. It's been really nice just to relax. Oh, have that piece of eggplant. It's ready. It's perfect. You don't want it yes. to get cold. Oh my gosh, this is like buttery and delicious. Mmm. It's like so smooth and creamy. Mmm. Mmm. There's something really umami Moorish about this. Mmm. I love the it. The hickory, maybe? Oh, yeah. Could be. That or just the, or the charcoal. It tastes more smoky than we have done before. Mm -hmm. I think it's better quality. Uh, coal also. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you filming or just looking? Okay. Just take this one in. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a little bit in here. Mm. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Mmm. <gasps> it's hot and good. If you have the opportunity to get out more rurally, to support local farmers or farmers markets, I suggest you do it. Yes, the produce might be slightly more expensive, but you're small, supporting small industry, local growers, and allowing these people to continue, to continue to bring us beautiful, fresh, organic vegetables that are not, uh, 
subject to this monoculture overproduction. <sighs> and you get the imperfect vegetables. The imperfectness is so cute. I'm so happy that I have an amazing friend who was able to come out and spend some time with me, help me take care of my shoulder, so I wasn't always pushing myself. And this trip we took to take a break from all of the building work, van building you've seen on Amanda's channel, and next week I have some little building updates from my van that we did together, and Amanda was amazing to help me out with some of these projects. So I can't wait to share that with you next week. But it was really cool to take a farm stand tour adventure, see a little bit more of the area around some of the places I frequent, and just turn it into quite an event. It was so fun. If you enjoyed watching this episode, please give it a big thumbs up down below. It really makes a difference. Share my video with somebody who you think might also be interested. That really helps out a lot. If you haven't already subscribed, I really appreciate it. And a huge big, big, big thank you to my Patreons. I really love you. Uh, I appreciate your support, especially over the last few months when I've been having a bit more of a tough time post-injury and some other personal stuff. Thank you. I really love it. And thanks for watching. Bye.